Hey YouTube, this is Tefeg Matt, and once again I'll be showing you another tutorial. This one's going to be on Mac and how to unlock bootloader for your Galaxy Nexus GSM, Verizon, or Sprint. This will work for any Galaxy Nexus. So this includes, I already just said, GSM, Verizon LTE CDMA, and Sprint LTE CDMA. So why do you want to unlock your bootloader? Unlocking bootloader lets you complete the first step of rooting your phone or installing Cloud Not Recovery. Rooting your phone will let you do many things. Some of the things are like set CPU, underclock, overclock, all that good stuff, titanium backup. And Clockwork Mod will let you install new ROMs, new themes, uh, mods, all that, all that good stuff. So it's all positive stuff, nothing's bad. Even if it says it's going to void your warranty, you can always lock the bootloader. So let's get started. First thing you need to do is just turn your phone and go into settings. All the way down to developer options and turn on USB debugging right there turn on USB debugging and OK now just plug in your phone via micro USB and the other side to the USB port so set that there so you can see the other side USB port ok now you can see on my computer screen that I have a zip file and a folder unzip this file and you'll get this folder once you get that extracted open the folder up and you will see ADB, Fast Boot, and Click Me Tool. Click on the Click Me Tool. And here it says make sure that you have USB debugging and press enter. So I'm, I have USB debugging enabled, so let me just give you a good angle on that. Okay? And just press enter and we'll do everything by itself automatically. This is the easiest tool ever. And there you go, it's done. Right there, you can see that focus. Give it a few seconds. Let me zoom out. Usually, works when I zoom out. So now, give it a few seconds, and there you go. It says unlocked. That means your phone is unlocked. And if you found this tool helpful, you can see right there, I did create this tool. So help me out. Uh, and there you go. I got my. Let's see if it focuses. There you go, it, says, it has my YouTube username and my website. So thanks for watching you guys, this is TankFank9. If you found this video helpful, please do not forget to subscribe as that does help me out a lot. I mean like a lot. It does really help support me, it shows people that, other, that you support me, you care, that you um, like my videos and I should keep going. And if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to rate or comment if you have any questions and I will respond to you within 24 hours. And I did start a new thing, I support... I, I have email support at techmac9 at gmail.com. I will respond within 24 hours on any Android problem that you're having. And if you're a subscriber, please you leave your YouTube username in the subject with the problem or anything else you want to provide. And I will respond to you a much faster time. So subscribe if you want to get a faster response. And leave it in the description. And as always, don't forget to check out my buddy, Android 7, where he has everything like this for Galaxy S3, Galaxy Note, and Skyrocket. And as always, don't forget to check out AndroidTech.blogspot.com where we have tutorials and everything for this and much more. Thanks for watching, guys.